We have the- well, we have a lot of prestige. We have the prestige where we could raise some more. I think we probably should, so let's go ahead and disband you, because I'm going to need to focus on just having bigger armies. So let's go ahead and make you a 400, 400, 400. Do I want to go all the way to 5? Do I? I have nothing else to spend these resources on. A new air, Sun and air. Praise Freya. Aleta has given birth to a perfect little son. So what are we going to name you? That's a good question. I need to pull up my list of subscribers. And see what's available. Odium Infinitus. How the blazes do you spell that? May you grow to be strong and wise, Odium Infinitus. Okay. Done. Odium sounds awfully like Odin. I like it. Yep. Ah, yeah, and we can have another regiment as well now, which I think we were going to make into light horsemen. So let's go ahead and do that. <laughs> this is going to be costing me a small fortune in piety. Sorry, in prestige. No, I don't care about prestige. Piety is the one I'm after. So this is okay. And this is also going to raise my army minimum to like 2,600. Why not invade Utrecht? Um, cause they're part of Lotharingia and would have 4,600 troops. <laughs> that would be why. But we could definitely go after Hilders. They have 1,600 men. So let's wait until we've got some more reinforcements. Then yes, we can absolutely do that. Although we could also just go for Yomsland. Oh man, they are so weak right now. You are currently fighting Powys in the Yumtlandic conquest of Oriel. So this is Yumtland that's going for Oriel, which I think is over here. That's Carrick. That's Anglesey. Yeah, Oriel there. So they're fighting against Powies for a little chunk of Ireland. And if we were theoretically to declare war on you, uh, it's just you. Chieftain of Moray. So we'd be fighting these two who are adjacent to each other. Moray has 500, you have 600. We significantly outnumber you, especially once all of these armies are up to full strength. I think that's going to be our next move, because I need to start taking and then consolidating the territories um, for the holy sites. My, uh, yeah, my objective right now is to reform the faith. I was thinking I needed the uh, tribal innovation. I don't. I just need to reform the faith. So that's also going to need a bucket load of piety. And you get piety, I think, from the holy sites. Well, there is at least a... Yes, you do. Temple holding there. Almost maxed out on Bowman. Then it's just going to be the Light Horseman. Which is going to be another three months. Four months. Don't care about having full levies. 
Uh, the other thing I can do... Huzzah! Is... Put out another invitation for champions. It'll cost 150, I think that's a price worth paying. Although, has that just made it so I can't now attack you? No. Oh, that costs piety to... No, that is... Wait. Is that piety or... Yeah, that's... It's a different symbol to my piety symbol, but I'm pretty sure that's piety. Luftwaffle gifted a sub to Ockmill. Ockmill, congratulations on the gifted sub, courtesy of Luftwaffle. Thank you for that. Much appreciate it. Do you get a bonus for converting the holy sites? I don't think so. I think you just get a bonus to piety if you control them, which we would. The only downside to this is we're going to be really quite spread out. Rikolfa wishes to join us. You have 20 prowess. Welcome! Three more months. Friendly exchange. Ellen gained 20 opinion. Because she and her letter have been talking. Olvia has been swayed. Okay, so Olvia quite likes us now. So I think that we probably want to start swaying these three. Thankfully the uh, Godai likes us because we have really high positive relations with church and state. Which I think is one of the theology buffs that he's been giving me. So let's go for Marshal Dag now because Marshal is definitely... The mayor, rather. Is definitely one of the most powerful people in our realm. Let's do that. Negotiate an alliance. Yes, absolutely. My dear brother, I eagerly propose to formalize the ties that already bind us together by sending an alliance between our two realms. Hell yeah, we're allied with Gotland. Family's got to stick, or stick together like that. Alright, do we have full troops? We... no, next month. And now. Now we do. Okay, so, Yumtland, while you are busy, we are going to declare war on you for you all nuts. I need to be illustrious. What am I at the moment? I am distinguished. I need another bit for illustrious, which is going to require us to go raiding. So, uh, I think we'll start going raiding. And I'm going to be taking command of this. We'll go for Mercia. That was our intention in the first place. But now we have a surprisingly strong raiding army, so... I'm pretty happy to take some risks here. Still not enough to go after Wessex. That was definitely a uh, Stein thing. Now, as I was saying earlier, I'm actually pretty happy to let Gotland just continue growing. Because the more that Gotland achieves, the more renown we gain. Remember, it's family-wide, it's not just me. 
So having Gotland splitting off and doing their own thing up here, fine. I'm totally okay with it. And if they get attacked, I'll protect them. How much of the duchy does Yomtland hold, though? Um, not a huge amount, but all I need is Trondheim. I don't actually care about the rest of the duchy. All I need is the county. Likewise with Sjelland, likewise with um, Uppsala. Llama wants me to drink some tea. We have another champion. Consider yourself... Oh, 30... Prowess. He's a giant blade master. Hell yeah. He's so big, he actually goes off the top of the screen. Recruit. Welcome to the good guys. Can you declare just for a county? Yes, you can. High Spirits, thank you very much for the follow. Death Punch, Rengzo, Dejax, thank you very much for the follows. Welcome to the channel. Oh, and Sindrin, Pillage, then Burn. And Fishbob, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the channel. Fire and blood. Send the captives back to Amsterdam. Amsterdam is 9 development already. Excellent. Control is up to 89. So we're getting a lot of the resources from Amsterdam at this point. It's just too bad I can't build anything here because I don't know how. They're using this newfangled feudal buildings. And I just can't master that architecture. Burger, level 16. Welcome. So now we're getting a pretty good number of different champions available to us. We're doing 62 out of the 200 that I can carry. Yeah, we lose 100 moving here, but worth, I think. Somewhat surprised. Oh, I guess we do outnumber them by 700. I was going to say I'm a bit surprised that Mercia is not trying to at least fight us and stop us from doing this, but we outnumber them pretty heavily. So this is just free money for us. the scrub thank you very much for the seven month resubscription very much appreciate that i found you because of crusader kings 2 i'm happy to be a mod link for crusader kings 3 well glad to hear that i've been looking forward to this for a while level of devotion impact plus 100 
Convert faith in county. Time it takes to convert a county has no longer increased that faith as a higher fervor than you. Uh, I have a feeling that Norse has a very high fervor level. So Catholicism fervor right now is 37. Norse fervor or Austeru fervor right now is 100. So that is not a penalty for us. We convert really quickly. Lifestyle. So I don't necessarily need religious icon, although it does lead to profit. What's level of devotion do? Faithful would be higher opinion. So it would just be more opinion with the clergy, which is also kind of meh. So I'm going to go religious icon, so we're just that one step closer to profit. What does Theologian give us? Plus three learning, plus 20 monthly piety. Yeah, this is definitely going to be the character to do the reformation. It's just down to whether or not we can get the territory required. Where next? Northampton. We're definitely going to be making a pretty penny from this foray. I'm imagining a group of Vikings scratching their heads and going, So, uh, guys, this, this feudal thing, how are we going to, um, you know, ad adopt it? Seems a bit beyond me, to be honest. Bit weird, bit different. Mayor Dag's been swayed. There, we need a court physician. Yes, we do. Do we have anyone that would naturally be a fit right now? Actually, yes, Ingbjorg. Who was actually the court physician previously. So we need to go to our court, then we need to go down to Ingbjorg, and then we just need to say... More. No, not those. More. There it is. Point as court physician. Pay you another ten ducats, just like my father did. For the same job. Norse settlement and the installation of new administration, the people of Zeeland have now fully endorsed Norse traditions. Good. So now we're going to promote culture up here in Vestfriesland and turn them Norse as well. But we're starting to get a better hold of all of the territories here. And Amsterdam, how valuable a province are you? You are actually almost level 10. And then we'll see if you're capped at level 10 or not. Because at the moment you're getting really positive, just natural growth. And we have also increased the control. So we should start controlling the next place. Which is your job. So Zaylon's control is probably the one that we need to work on first. Because it's the second biggest province after Holland. Okay, looting done. Going there would take attrition. Going here, however, would not. And that would bring us to 164, which would then be enough. We can then head home. Uh, especially as we take attrition from moving there. We're locked in. But I would say that this has been a good bit of profiteering. I think we'll sway... Marshal Dag one more, Mayor Dag one more time, and then we'll start working on somebody else. In the meantime, you may as well head home, and going via Wessex will not actually cause you attrition, because we ain't raiding it. We're just passing through, don't worry, Alfred. You don't need to come and kill us, we're not, we're not raiding you. We were just going after your hated um, neighbours to the north, so forget about it, Alfred. It's all good. We have no problems between us, right?
Home sweet home. So we just brought back another bunch of prestige. Richard Shrew, thank you very much for the raid. Hello, hello, hello to all of Richard's viewers. How are you all doing today? Have you also been enjoying CK3? Or what have you been up to? So, we are currently in Holland. We could continue our raids on Mercia. Huzzah! Richard True, thank you very much for the four month resubscription. Very much appreciate that. Hello to you too. Just got into it. Be an interesting jump into multiplayer on. You actually got multiplayer working? Because I was supposed to be doing a multiplayer stream earlier today and we, it just wouldn't work. We were going to be hosted by Paradox and everything, but just nope. Yeah, midges. Angle C is already on fire. I wonder... Is the... Oh, yeah, the interior is worth so much money. Oh, okay. We're going to go to Cheshire. Sorry, Mercia, but you have a second coastline and I'm going to exploit that fact. Actually, before we go, before we go, before we go, before we go, before we go disband. We will... Oh, boy! You recover manpower incredibly quickly. 50 a month. Interesting. So the larger your stacks of your units, the faster they regain manpower as well. Huh. Although, admittedly, it is costing me a small fortune in prestige. But we gain quite a lot of prestige when we raid stuff, so it's all good. Denmark holds bits of Ireland. Well, the funny thing about Ireland is there's only one bit that's actually Irish, and that's me. They're right in the middle. <laughs> Everything else has been taken by a Viking of some description. Except for Debenuth. Those are uh, Welsh. Viking, 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 Viking. No, Welsh, Welsh, Viking, Welsh. And Jumpland actually won the fight for that. They're down to just 80 soldiers, though. Ah! I need to become illustrious, then I can attack them. Is Ireland still good for starting? Yes. Especially in 1066. It's probably a bit more difficult in 867 because of all the Vikings. But 1066 start as Ireland is definitely the way to learn the game. 100%. Had to use the ID thing to join a game. We were, just didn't work. How does the army cost prestige? Because we're tribal, not feudal. Ormir has died. That was my counsellor. Uh, so we do need to bring in a new steward. Roggenwalder. Oh no, that would be a reassign. Those are all reassigns. Wow, we have a distinct lack of good stewards in this realm. Blimey. Huh. So I think what I'm gonna do is reassign Dog. as the steward and then the marshal can be Helmar where's my giant buddy he's disappeared yeah he has I guess somebody else poached him well that's irritating I paid for him So I was just going to make Giant Man my counsellor. I 
And yeah, it's gonna be a Kelma. Compliment. To make your steward major Mayor Dag more susceptible to my attempts at approaching him, I can include some kind of compliment in my next missive to court. Uh, you are temperate, deceitful, and wrathful. We will talk of his relentless courage. Sure. He is a fighter after all. He liked it. Okay, we are ready to raise a new army. Let's go over here. And hit Mercia again. Sorry, Mercia. Not sorry at all. Gained a level of devotion. You are known for your dedication to the faith. So we are now faithful. Next up will be devoted servant. And we are gaining quite a lot of piety just every month. Odium infinitus. Lost in thought. You have become pensive. Right, I have not set a guardian for you yet, have I? Ah, you now have a education trait. See, it really needs to tell you that you can now start educating. It never does. You would be good at diplomacy or learning. You're currently curious. Girls can be priests. Um, and you are better at learning right now. And then you don't have an education, neither do you. Ellen can marry again. Again. Um, the one province of Sweden up there. Yeah, not sure I'm convinced by that one. And that's that random province of Gardariki. He is a Rurikson, though. That's going to mean a lot of prestige. And he's also quick. Oh, hell yes. 600 prestige for that. Sent. Alliance formed. Good stuff. And we are now in entwined with Rurik's dis dynasty. No, I think there are some other people trying to raid Cheshire at the same time. It's mine. Oh no, they're running away. It's fine. And they acknowledged it was mine. And then it was all fine. Nine ducats, nine ducats. Just just take everything. County corruption. Oh, we lost the uh, smuggling ring because we've got more control. Excellent. I'm okay with that. 